guys, I went ahead and I bought the cheapest four-stroke motor that I could find on Amazon. It's right here. And so far, it hasn't been pretty. This video is made puzzle by calls. Look at this. The best tackle store there is online. No, they're not a sponsor in this video. They're not paying me for this video. But guess what, guys? You could help because if you sign up for a calls membership that pays for itself, you're going to be able to save 30, 40% off incredible baits, fresh water, salt water, brand new base that you cannot find anywhere all the information about calls and everything link below check the description support the channel let's go we're right here at biscay national park today it is 4 17 pm and i had this crazy idea of bringing this brand new motor that we got off amazon for 329 dollars on the pelican premium getaway and we were gonna have a day here we were gonna catch fish and all that stuff but look at that conditions are just terrible but you know what is worse this motor here now i'm gonna take you back when we bought it when we did the unboxing the first few trials and stay to the end so you hear my honest first impression of this product right here i don't even know why i say honest because i'm always honest with you guys i get in trouble with a lot of people because i speak my mind and this is not an exception watch the full video please and come back and comment let me know what you think ah hey guys welcome to another amazing episode of motoring stuff with alex right here we got a 325 dollar outboard motor from amazon it's gonna be crazy now this is a can k i don't even know if you say it like that it is a four horsepower motor it weighs about 27 pounds which i could tell you probably does because it's not that heavy so let's go ahead and unbox this thing luckily Look at this thing. Go ahead and put some oil. All right guys, from what I gather, <laughs> and I didn't do a lot of research on this motor, but it looks like this is air cool. It's not water cool, it doesn't pee. This looks like a landmower engine right here, motor, whatever you wanna call it. So I'm gonna turn it on quickly so you guys see how it works. All you have to do is prime this right here. It's already primed. It should just run because it's hot. I mean, just. The manual doesn't say anything about breaking in the engine, but I'm gonna break it anyways. Also, it doesn't say exactly what oil to put in, but it does show that it's 10 W30. I must be really crazy to take this this boat this pelican get away through that water over there look at that that looks nasty as hell definitely gonna need a paddle oh my god I can't believe I'm actually doing this okay guys how many of you think this is a horrible good for nothing idea oh my god like seriously dude look look at all the weed See we oh, the good news is a high time. High time. That's excellent news. This motor leaks. See how it leaks over there? Not good. So you gotta be careful how you transport this thing. See what's up. Alright, see a problem sitting over here. The water comes in. Guys, this is a bad idea! We're gonna have to do some changes here. Let's go close to shore, put the sea away, and see what we can do. Because so far, this is not working. Now, first trial, 
didn't work so well so i'm gonna i'm gonna remove some stuff up here and see what happens when we do the second trial Let's do this. I'm always getting the paddle the wrong way, I don't know why. disaster it doesn't even move the boat i'm gonna try to do a few things to it i'm gonna try to change the oil i think it, it probably like right now grass got in there this is a complete failure oh my god we try guys we try Look, this is not the perfect condition to test this, but even Bispy will go here three and a half, four miles an hour. Like if I go with the wind and, and the wave, Bispy four and a half, this thing, I don't think it even hit two miles an hour. I don't know what's going on with it. I don't know, I'm gonna test it on, on the Cash Power 100 because that boat is lighter. Maybe we go three, four miles an hour. So far, not, not impressed at all. There's a reason why I never bothered to buy one of these motors before and that's because I thought it was going to be trash. Boy was I right. Now there's a few things I want to test with this motor that is going to come in other videos. Like I want to change the oil, I want to try on a different boat, something that is designed to take an outboard. But so far we had it on two boats. This one the Pelican Premium which th shouldn't even be here. But we also had it on the Johnny Bass 100 and it wasn't pretty. I, I didn't watch any videos on YouTube before I bought it because I don't like to watch videos from other people before I do something because I don't want to copy them. I want to have my own opinion about stuff. But I did watch videos after I took it out on the water and I tested it for myself to see if I was the one who was doing something wrong. But even on those videos, the maximum speed was like four miles an hour. This thing has a different design. It's more like a jet style. So take a mile away, still three miles, but dude, we didn't even get that here. And when coming back, it was to a point where we didn't even get two miles an hour. We were like in the same place. I don't know what happened. I'm gonna go put it on the right boat and take it out again tomorrow. But that video is not gonna be this one. As a consumer, I don't think I got a good product back because it doesn't even work. So I'm gonna be returning this unit. And that's, I'm making it public, I'm gonna return it. I think I can return it. Cause it just did not deliver. And I feel like I have to do more than just one video. This initial video. And then I'm gonna do a final review. Now this unit I don't think is even available. Like I tried to, to locate it on Amazon, it was gone. Maybe it's there by now. But all the motors that you're gonna see four stroke, fourth HP they're the same thing and I truly had a horrible experience with it so far like you're better off buying a water snake and a small battery lead acid seal battery and you're probably gonna go faster 